Okay. This is all yours. Under this new world of self-identification, can, as I did earlier, now identify as a two-spirit Neutroys penguin. There are a hundred different genders on this BBC list, apparently, mm -hmm. right? One of them is two-spirit person, polygender, pangender, neutroids. I Benjamin, what is neutroids? But, oh, come on, are we going to go through all 100? Do you know any of them? I need well, I to know, know them, what yeah. 99 Mate, you come, No offence, you no, come no, on no. national television to defend the BBC telling kids there are 100 genders. Mm. I'm now reading out a number of these 100 genders. A, you've never heard of them. Mm. B, you've no idea what they are. But C, you no. want to encourage Hang the on. BBC to instruct our kids that they should be one of these genders. But that isn't the point. The fact is... That, that is the point. The fact is that people identify in different ways. And when you get bogged down by the idea that children might know that they're different, that they might be helped to understand why they're different, that the teachers teaching them might be prepared with the apparatus to explain it to them. That is a good thing. A so hundred you, I but you might, parents, parents, surely. Difference. Do you know what Neutroids is? You might find it strange and unusual, and we might not be able to answer what every one of the 100 is. But that doesn't you mean doesn't that they know don't exist. Well, you've, I suspect you picked the, the no, two most... No, I've literally... I haven't heard of there's an A to, to B today. list, and you I'm have, just picking them at random. You have things like... So far, I've picked three, then you have no idea what they are. Do you know what too. New Troys is? Uh, tell me, tell me. Well, have, a like stab, me. have a stab, have a stab. Well, OK, I don't know. I don't Imagine know you're a nine-year-old kid and the BBC's told you to be one of these, so what's New Troys? Well, no, that's not what would happen. What would happen is the kid would say how they're feeling... Here's what New teacher, Troys is. The so teacher might you be want to, tell to help nine... explain Have you got any kids? Uh, no, I don't. Okay, I've got four kids, right, including three boys, right? So I'm just trying to imagine a conversation with my three when they were nine, and my daughter's nearly nine as well, Jesus, mm -hmm. like seven and a half, right? Uh, new Troys, someone with a null or neutral gender being neither male nor female, and in some cases a person who may also seek to reduce signs of their physical sex, right? Neutroids. What is like wrong that. with just being male, female or trans? And just have your personality. In other words, three things. But, You're male or female, or you identify as something else, right? But there are well, lots what we don't do is have these hundred the ridiculous terms that even you, the world expert on gender, <laughs> has no idea what any of them are. Can I, this is all yours. under this new world of self-identification, can, as I did earlier, now identify as a two-spirit Neutroids penguin. Well, you're not, you're not a penguin because Jesus a bit of Why? Common sense. Why? Who says I'm not? Well, I mean, that's not a thing that happens. Why? This is the distinction. People do identify I'm as actually a two genders. spirit Neutroids pangender penguin. And how they dare don't, you? People don't How dare you tell me I can't identify as that? There are so many gender identities. So we know we've got male and female, but there are over a hundred, if not more, gender identities now. So we know that some people might feel like they're two different genders.